So, what it do, what it do, what it do. What's going on, YouTube? I go by the name of Kel, and I want to welcome each and every one of you to my new channel. Uh, the name of my channel is called Riding with Kel. Have you ever wondered, you know, what it's like to be a truck driver? Have you ever wondered what the truck driver lifestyle was like? Well, with Riding with Kel, you get all of your answers and a little bit more. A lot of people think when they think of truckers, they think of Hey Eastbound, you got your ears on? About a few miles past that chicken coop around Yardstick 324, you got a city kitty taking pictures. Mm, nah. It's more like... Mm, okay, that's more closer to it. I mean, because think about it, being a truck driver is one of the most dangerous jobs in the world. But it's also most, one of the most rewarding jobs in the world also. It's one of the most dangerous jobs because every single day you're carrying around 40 to 50 to 60,000 pounds or whatever the commodity of the day is. Yes, this trailer and these wheels can hold a lot of weight a lot of weight so it's very dangerous because you're on the road moving 60 70 miles per hour and you got little four wheelers that's doing 80 and 90 just trying to cut you off you know and all that good stuff so it's pretty dangerous but it's fun too because every single day of the week i go on a different vacation i'm in a different state every day of the week and that's fun so for my foodies out there, I definitely travel and try some of the best food the United States has to offer. For my truckers out there or wanting to be truckers, I put you on game and show you how things go. So hopefully you have an easier transition when you come across to this side. So one of the first things you want to do when you get to a shipper or to a receiver is you want to get a lay of the land. I want to see how all of this looks. I want to see what holes are more open than other holes. I want to see what's going to be tight. So from what I see, so from what I see, the hole that we're going to go in is right here. Now there's different ways that people like um, back into holes. You got this thing called like the eight figure S maneuver where you make like the eight and you pull up such and such and such. I don't do all that. I was trained a little differently. So what you want to do is you want to pull up past the hole like this. maneuvers the corner of the truck and steers it into the hole that you need to go to.
Yo, what's up, family? Yeah, so as you can see, today's been a pretty chill day overall. I loaded up my load. I got the paperwork for my load, and I signed off for my load, and now I'm back on the road. Um, like I said, this 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 trucking trucking is a it's the perfect dangerous job for an introvert. Um, I mean, it's the perfect dangerous job for anybody. But yeah, um, like I said, you know, this channel is going to be educational and it's going to be food driven. So um, the next place that I went to get food from, uh, it was raining. So I decided not to go in. I just ordered it. Um, but, you know, as the weather gets better, I would definitely go in the restaurants just to give the family a idea and a feel for how the actual restaurant is. But um, there's this Jamaican spot in Waco, Texas. It's called... Uh, true Jamaican. Now, when I tell you this food is hidden, this food is hidden. Like, hidden, hidden. Like, it's on point. Yeah, you know, matter of fact, pig. Nice little spread. Let's see what we got going on. Woo! 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 Rasta pasta man. Rasta pasta man. That looks good. Looks healthy and all that good stuff. Got it here. What is it without that? You already know what we're here for, right? Yeah. And Well, family, I'm winding it down. This is what all truckers do near the end of their shift. It's part of the lifestyle, family. Find a nice spot that a big 53-foot truck can, can chill in. Luckily, up north, they have a lot of those and some places down south. And pretty much just kick it for the rest of the night. You got 10 hours to just rest recuperate and start your new day off and do big things and, and win and that's what it's all about family it's about winning so until I meet your city we shall meet again I want to thank each and every one of you for taking the time out to just check out my journey and I will keep them coming. Until next time, family. You are riding with Kevin. Peace.